Hi there, Natalie Carrado with Remax Alliance and LivingDenver.com. And I just wanted to tell you today is beautiful. It's about 65 degrees when just the day before yesterday it was a blizzard. And uh, loving Colorado weather. So wanted to let you know about staging your house. Is it best to stage your home or is it best to just go ahead and save that money and empty the home? Um, obviously some people say well what if my home doesn't sell then I have to empty it and then move all of my things back in well not really because in this market in Denver it's so crazy that yes your home's probably gonna sell unless it's absolutely destroyed even if it's a fixer-upper um, guarantee it's going to sell and say you have hardwood floors under that carpet in that property um, it's best to pay a hundred dollars get that carpet out of there and leave the hardwoods as is I think you're gonna get more money for that and that's why I'll come and meet with you and explain what you can do to get the most money out of your home but it really is great to have a blank canvas to let buyers come in and imagine their own furniture their own items in the home and um, then make that decision of whether they want to um, you know purchase your home I really think that an empty home is better at this point in this market than spending the money on staging because it's going to go under contract so quickly most likely um, also one more thing I was going to mention was you have to move anyway so kind of like our uh, you know myself I moved about a year ago and I knew I was moving anyway so I went ahead and got a pod and just loaded as much as I possibly could into that pod and it's just less less work that I have to pack in 30 to 45 days when it comes time to close. So yes, if you can, empty out your house as much as possible and then we'll get really good photos and uh, go from there. But call me, I'll come by and tell you more of what you can do to get the most out of your home. My number is 720-288-0101 or you can email me natalie at livingdenver.com. Thank you so much and I hope you have a blessed day.